It's time for the mic drop on each show by going deep on one topic affecting our community in hopes we can all learn a little more. Now, when I was a single man, I used to live right off of 14th and U Street, right in the mix of everything. And I loved it. In fact, I still do. I may not live there anymore, but that little pocket of DC, the U Street corridor still has my heart. The old school DC energy still living there will always make me feel warm. And the people who generate it will always make me feel welcome. That's a special place to me, one that I feel protective of, which is why the shooting that took place at Mochella there yesterday has left me feeling raw. The injuries, the loss of a 15-year-old to gun violence, the mental trauma that the people in the crowd went through and are, I'm sure, still experiencing, which is probably akin to the trauma that the Metro police officers who were on the scene also have to be feeling. All of it has left me feeling down. That's the only way I can think to describe it, is just down. Down over what happened, and down over what I know may be coming. Mochella is one of my favorite DC developments in the last few years. Coming out of the Don't Mute DC movement, the free concerts might make it seem like it's just about the go-go music, but it's so much more than that. Mochella is a response from longtime residents to their feeling of losing DC's culture, the culture they feel is being eaten away by gentrification. And they're not wrong. They've watched the DC they knew change right in front of them as a new class of people have moved into the city while they, their families and friends, have been moved out, taking the soul of the place with them. So the concerts serve as a reminder of what DC was, a raging against the dying of the light. My fear is that there'll be an attempt to use yesterday's violence to dim the light even faster, tying gun violence to the culture, to the music, and invariably to blackness. Gun violence in DC is a pervasive problem. It has been for a while. We all know this, but it's a problem everywhere, even in places where go-go music isn't played. Muting DC isn't the answer. But there does have to be some accountability for the events that unfolded yesterday. It might in fact be time to end the renegade pop-up spirit of Mochella. And if that's what it will take to keep the culture alive, then maybe we have to do what we'll have to do. Because for many of us, DC needs the culture. We need the culture, just as we need gun violence to end. All right, that's it for Open Mic. We'll be back the same time tomorrow. I want to wish all of you fathers out there a happy belated Father's Day. I hope you guys have a beautiful one. And for today, I wish you guys a happy Juneteenth. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Have a great night.